And how's it growing, everybody? Thanks for tuning in. Dino back with another one. So, what I got today is my compost tea. And it's going to be real quick and easy. So, got fish for Alaskan fish fertilizer. Honey that I get from a local um, bee farmer. Organic molasses, worm castings, homemade worm castings. This is homemade. This is not, this is, I made this myself. And chicken compost, chicken manure compost, and cow manure compost and a big barrel I already added the fish fertilizer and molasses and then I've got my pump this is my uh, aqua farm or not sorry not aqua farm hydro, hydro farm um, commercial size pump this was the biggest one. Picked it up on Amazon for um, I think a little under a hundred bucks. But uh, check it out; works awesome. So let's add the honey. And I'm adding the sugar because I'm feeding the microbes, the bacteria. This is a bacteria. This is actually going to be a nice fungal back, fungal and bacteria tea. But the sugar, the honeys, the honey and the molasses, aka sugars, are for the microbes and bacteria. So let's add one more. I'll be back with you when the pump is on. Thanks for tuning in. See you in a minute. One more thing. I also did add the rest of this. Wasn't very much. Only like the little bottom right here. Maybe to the line. To the sticker line. I did add the rest of this. Um, this will probably be the last year I use the Super Thrive. Since seeing that everything is going great without it. So... Uh, stay tuned. I'll be back. Thanks. I want to show real quick how sticky these castings are. And I don't know if you guys can hear this. The moisture content. And look at that. That's how your castings should be. It should stick together real easily. easily. And if you want to know how I am making my castings, check out... Jeff Lawton's video um, on how to make worm castings out of a cast iron tub. Best system I've ever used, and I'll do another video on that showing that. So stay tuned, I'll be back. Thanks. 
Another thing to show you. Not sure if everybody can see him. Wiggling around. Now, these are at the bottom of that pile of castings. Now, my worm bin that I started when I moved here. So as I was saying before the camera cut off and my memory card ran out of space, um, I was saying that I started with less than that handful of worms I showed you maybe about half of that and in six months i've got so much worms i can't even count so check it out jeff lawton's video on um, worm castings how to make homemade worm castings uh, using a cast iron tub um, great video but anyways i gotta get off to work and here is my Compost tea pump in action. As y'all can tell, I upgraded. So, I took my bucket and I said, fuck. Anyways, peace out, y'all. Thanks for tuning in. And uh, as always, live free, stay ivory. Peace.